Hey guys, you're welcome back to SNS Kitchen. You're very welcome. If you are new here, a warm welcome to you. Okay, on today's episode, I'll be making this yummy and delicious chicken and cabbage sauce. This this third absolutely delicious. Without wasting much of a time, let's delve into the making. To my heated oil, I added the grated garlic and grated ginger. I'm going to be adding the onions as well. I'm going to stir well till the onion turns translucent. This is going to take two minutes. And after two minutes of stir frying, I'm going to introduce the chicken into the pot. This is soft chicken, okay? When I'm done adding everything, I'm going to leave that to fry on this side for 10 minutes. And after 10 minutes of frying on one side, I'm gonna flip over to the other side and I'll be leaving that to fry again for another 10 minutes. And while that is frying, I'll go ahead and cut my cabbage. I've washed that thoroughly, okay? I'll be using half of this cabbage and I'll be cutting behind the camera, yeah? And this is 10 minutes of frying. Right now, I'm gonna be flipping that to the other side to fry. Guys, please make sure you fry on a medium heat. Do not fry this on a high heat, okay? And after 20 minutes of frying, the chicken is ready. It is half done. So at this point, I'm going to be adding enough water to make the sauce. When I'm done adding the water, I'm going to go ahead and start seasoning that immediately, okay? To this, I added my chicken seasoning powder, vegetable seasoning powder, and bouillon powder and I'll be adding the white pepper as well followed by my chili flakes this chili flakes is very spicy so I added the salt and seasoning cube I'll be adding some onions to that as well and I'm gonna stir well to combine I'll cover this and let it cook for another 10 minutes and this is 10 minutes of boiling I'm gonna be adding the vegetable at this point okay so I added the corn peas and carrot this is frozen okay and I'm gonna be adding red bell peppers and my cabbage yeah this is chicken and cabbage sauce please add enough cabbage you're gonna love it I'm telling you so I'm gonna stir very well to combine and I'll let this to cook for another two minutes please do not overcook the veggies okay and after two minutes of cooking it is time for me to add my thickener here i'm using sauce binder as thickener make use of cornstarch if that's what you have you can also make use of flour that is all-purpose flour to thicken yours okay i stay well to combine and i'm gonna turn off my cooker and add the spring onions i want my spring onions to be very fresh and crunchy okay so guys we are virtually done with this recipe you can save this for christmas or for thanksgiving i promise you your family will enjoy it honestly yeah and that brings me to the end of today's episode thank you so much for watching until i come your way next time remain blessed i love you bye bye bye